Hey my friends, Sam Haymart. For Test Driven TV, I just did a thing. I did a thing. I bought a used car using Carvana, the online car dealership that really cuts out the entire process of dealerships and salesmen and the whole nine yards. Something I wanted to try for a while to see if it rises to all the hype we've been hearing about what an easy process it is and what a fair process it is. Here's how it went. If you hadn't heard about it, Carvana.com is this online car dealership that allows you to shop a variety of different makes. Now, they don't have everything on the planet, but they've got most of the popular cars that are out there. And from what I've seen, typically they range up to about 10 years old. And there, there's a pretty good set of, of every brand that's out there except for some really expensive exotics. And what this allows you to do is search their database of, as of today, over 17,000 cars. And in the website, you can choose your colors, you can choose options, and sort of narrow your search down to what you're looking for, be it a car, truck, uh, hybrid, whatever. The great thing about their website is it allows you to go in and do a full 360 degree view of the car inside and out. If it has flaws, you can see that because they're marked and noted right there on the website. And you can also do a car fax and you can pull up the full history of the car. And obviously they only have cars that are the tip top best out there, up to about 10 years old and the mileage, everything you need to know about the car is right there listed in the information. There's also photos you can look at. When it comes to actually doing the deal, you can bring your own financing if you have your own bank or you can use their financing. They've got this great little dashboard that you can sort of see what the payments are going to be based on your credit score or what you think your credit score is. And you can change that up and, and sort of play with the dials to see how that affects your payment. When it comes to getting your car, you can have the car delivered to your house or you can use one of their vending machines if they have one in your market. I have one here in Phoenix and so I think that's what I'm planning to do. I just need a small inexpensive car and I want something that's interesting and well a smart car is interesting so here I'm looking at the 360 degree view and here it shows where there's a flaw. This car has got some light scratches here on the passenger side so where there's imperfections it shows you. You can do 360 degree view the interior so you can see exactly what it looks like even though I prefer a bright color because here in the desert black is tough this one here is black but it's 8100 it has only 22,000 miles and therefore a lot of the factory warranty I don't actually have to get an extended warranty because it'll be still warranted for about two years after I buy it so I'm going to go ahead and get started with this one As you can see here, they're showing me an interest rate of 6.3%, $157 a month for the payment, total of 72 months, zero down, zero out of pocket right now, so it's just like ordering something online. And I'm going to save and continue. Wow, that was fast. So now it's giving me my contract for the car to sign right here. This is a purchase agreement. That was fast. Right here. I agree. Continue. There it is. I just signed a contract on a new car. Now in a dealership that process would have probably taken about an hour at minimum, maybe three or four, and it would have been a heartache mess rodeo from hell. I'm sitting here without my shirt on wearing my morning underwear and drinking coffee ordering a new car with my rabbit coffee cup. Alright, so um, it's been a day or two, but um, through phone calls and everything, it's a holiday weekend, so I didn't expect them to be super quick. But as far as the amount of time I've had to spend on this, it's actually been pretty good. I'd say I'm up to probably about 25 minutes. I've got my window sticker here, and I've just printed out my entire signed contract that I did completely online with DocuSign. It's all approved and ready to go, and I pick it up at the vending machine. 
All right, it's Saturday morning and I'm getting ready to go and actually pick up my new car and I was able to actually go through the website and get the information that I needed so that I could add it to my insurance. That's one of the requirements when I go to pick up the car. They want my driver's license and proof that I've added insurance. And at the last minute I was able to actually go in here and add the extended coverage warranty and it changed my payment just a little bit and the nice thing is, is it shows your entire dashboard here and the way it changed and I was able to sign and uh, get a new contract written up based on that because I'm a car guy and even though I always like the cars that I'm buying I realize I'm buying a French car and a used one at that so to speak so uh, even though it has low mileage and some warranty left on its factory warranty I decided that a car like this you get a warranty on and it was a good enough deal that uh, you know, if any one big thing went wrong, it'd pay for it right away. So I'm good with that. And so it raised my payment just a little bit. It's still under $200 a month, which is, uh, well, it's very good for a cheap little car. So I'm off and I'm going to take a shower and go pick up my car. When I got to the vending machine in Tempe, it was very exciting because they had my smart car at the very top of the building. And so it was kind of cool. I, obviously, I got a picture of that because it's kind of neat for posterity. Um, but it's it's been exciting to watch this come about because I watched this place get built and I knew I might buy a car from them one day and so that was my plan all along to uh, to make sure that I came here instead of just have it delivered to my house. So the whole experience here is that once you watch this very cool machine in motion it goes up and it gets the car off the platform it brings it down the tower and then as it comes out to where it's going to be moved into the delivery bay it does a little bit of a dance which is very cool and then it rolls out into the delivery bay and basically what happens here is is you get to go take a test drive and you get to really get a close look at the car to make sure it matches your expectations before you actually take delivery of it and so basically that's what I did here is I got a chance to go and sort of take a close look at the car and and see if there were any scratches or dents or any anything wrong with it that I didn't notice or see in the pictures and then I went off on my test drive and all of this is done because they have a seven day money back guarantee such that you don't have to worry about that I mean if, if after a week of driving the car you don't like it uh, you can just hand it back or if you test drive it right there on the spot you just say no I'm not going to take the car and you're done well, my friends, there you have it for my car buying experience on Carvana.com. I gotta say, I'm very pleased here. All in all, this took probably about 40 minutes start to finish, including the time I spent actually doing the process online and coming here at the dealership, at the vending machine. And I gotta tell you, even though you can have your car delivered at home if you don't have a vending machine in your area, if you do have one, you gotta do this. The theatrics of this and the experience is kind of fun. It really put me in a good mood. So, um, I would definitely recommend you try Carvana. Uh, that's my own experience. I'm not being paid. I'm not doing anything like that for this. This is just something I wanted to try out when I knew I wanted a used car. And um, it was probably the easiest car buying experience I've ever had. Now, I say that having bought a lot of cars online, probably about a half dozen, and uh, that's, those experiences have been good too, but uh, this was just very easy, it was cut and dried, and the best part about it is the numbers I got when I signed my contract and what I'm driving away with were exactly what it showed me on the website. There were, there were no hidden mirrors, there were no smoke, there was, there was nothing, right? I, I passed the whole dealership experience of the rodeo, the petting zoo, the bearded lady, and all of that crap. So uh, if you're in the traditional car business and you don't like what you just saw here, it's on you, you know? Car buying doesn't have to be a freaking rodeo. So I'm very pleased. Now, if you'd like to see more about this car, click right there. I'll have a video up very soon. Uh, in the meantime, if it's not there yet, you'll see my latest video. Also, subscribe to my YouTube channel right there because I love cars and, well, you never know what's going to come next.